partner on a collision course about the relevance of the administration's indigent housing program. This was highlighted at a recent handing over in Manchester. Over the last seven years, more than 100 houses have been constructed under the Indigent Housing Program. But Member of Parliament for Manchester Northwestern, Mikhail Phillips, questioned whether there was an overlap with several agencies providing housing solutions. When you have the HOPE program that has started for over seven years and only provided 160 houses, but that's 160 Jamaicans that never had proper housing. But how it is that we can get a program like that, which is a good program, to benefit more. In response, local government minister Desmond McKenzie contended that the four programs under the government's housing policy are well coordinated. He stressed that they have been consistent in responding to the housing needs of Jamaicans. If persons are going to be critical of our stewardship, of housing solutions in this country. You tell us what you will be able to do better than what we are doing. He added that there haven't been any complaints about the houses constructed under the program. We still continue to build more. Within the next four weeks, I'll be handing over at least another six. And there are more than 15 under construction taking place right across the country.